Over 12,000 rural women farmers have benefited from a project implemented by Sanapia Bat Savings and Loan Scheme. The three-year project at the Roots of Change is being implemented in Ghana and Yar Congo. It is supported by Opportunity International UK with funds worth £3.6 million sterling. This was revealed by the Senior Programs Manager of Opportunity International UK, Lydia Bafuwa, at a client engagement conference in WA. Join News Upper West correspondent Rafiq Salam has more. Snappy Abba Savings and Loans Company, with support from Opportunity International UK, embarked on a project which shot to, among other things, empower women financially by tackling farming innovatively whilst addressing the issue of gender. Throwing more light on the project, Chief Programs Manager of Snappy Abba Savings and Loans Company, Joyce also demonstrated that the aim of the project is to focus on rural women and low-income miners, especially farmers, to access financial services. It's aimed at supporting rural women. In our case, we're focusing mainly on farmers to access financial services. And what we did is to come up with innovative activities. So the way we support the women, the way we train them, the way we support them with various services to make sure that they are wholly empowered to be able to utilize the resources that we are giving to them. There is also a, a section of the training that looked at gender, both for their spouses and the community opinion leaders and for the women themselves, so that they all move onto a level what we call gender awareness or being gender proactive, so that together as, as a family unit and together as a community, we know and support the woman to be able to elicit herself, to come out of her own, to implement her skills and talent to the benefits of the family, the community, and even to that of the nation as a whole. Persons who are differently able were also supported in the project to be financially independent. Because we believe that when somebody is disabled, it doesn't mean that the person is disabled in their thinking or in, her, in his or her ability. They still have that knowledge, that skill to do something for themselves. And we are looking at they being resilient, they being sufficient, they being independent and, and being able to contribute also to life. And so the program focused on them, we trained them, gave them some support to be able to invest in some activity that will help them generate income for themselves and then for their family. Roots of change. After three years of existence, the project is coming to a close, hence the need to hold client engagement closer conference attended by some of the clients. We take a break, but do stay tuned in.